Hello and welcome to Chichi Automation. I am your friend Janice. In this video, we will see how can we generate HTML report in the Cypress. So let's begin. As we know, Cypress is built on top of Mocha. That means any reporter built for the Mocha can be used with the Cypress. We will be using Mocha Sum report. Let's open the terminal. Now to install the Mocha Sum, we can pass the command as npm install and we'll be adding the mocha awesome report as a part of dependency so we'll passing an option as save dev all right now when we execute cypress run command each of the spec files is processed completely separately during the executions thus each spec file generates the separate report files now to merge each of the generated output files in a single file we'll be using mocha sum merge again same thing we can install with the npn install dependency all right once we have merged the report files we can generate the HTML report with the help of Mocha Sum Report Generator. So finally, we can say that to generate the HTML report, we would require the Mocha Sum, Mocha Sum Merge, and Mocha Sum Report Generators. That's it. And click on the Enter. Let's open the package.json file where we can see that the all the three dependencies we have installed. Now let's configure reporters in a cypress.json files. Let's open it. Over here, we can configure the reporter like this way. Reporter as mocasm and we will be passing as an options that will be used for the reporters that contains the report directories where we would be generating our report. They should be part of the cypress result and the spec folders. As we discussed, each of the spec files is generated the separate report. If we are not passing the override is equal to false, it will override the previously generated report with the new report. So we need to pass the override is equal to false. And we would be passing HTML to be a false and we will be create the report in the JSON form. So this is the configuration for the mocasm. Alright, now let's go to packet.json files. Now to generate the report, we would be using this. It is nothing but it will execute the all the spec files. Those are under the login folders. So we'll see in the login folders, currently we have only one spec files. So let's add one more files, article.spec.js files, copy and paste into the login folder. Alright. Let's save this ipress.json file and let's close these files. Let's open the packet.json file. As we discussed, when we execute cypress run command, each of the spec files will generate the separate report files. So for that, we need to merge the each of the report. To, to merge the report, we would be creating one more script like this way. Over here, we would be calling the mocasm merge and we're passing as a generated JSON files and we'll be creating a single JSON files as a name of mocasm, right? Once the single merge file is generated, we would be creating the HTML report with the help of the mocasm report generator. For that, we would be creating a separate script generate the report. And we're passing a command as merge calling the previously generated mocasm json files over here and we are passing an options as a where we would be creating our report so we'll be creating a report inside the report directory cypress result and the file name will be our index.html files so basically what we need to do first we need to execute this command right that will create a separate spec files reports to merge these reports we will be calling these commands once it is created a single merge report in a mocha some json files we will be calling in the generate report rather than running individual commands from one by one we can create one more script that will call all these three scripts one by one like this way we have created the one more script as a test mocha some first one we are the npn run for this cypress run login folders then we will be calling the merge report and finally we will generate the report let's save it let's execute this command from the command line npm run test mocha some and click on enter let's maximize the terminal it will start executing from the login folders it found the two spec files as we have only two spec files name is articles and login So as we can see that our report has been generated on this location with the name of index.html. Let's open the report folder. You can see on the left hand side report folders and index.html. Let's open it. 
we have to spec first login and the articles if you can click on you can see the entire code over here on the left hand side we can filter out the past and fail these cases so that's it for today thank you